What's going on guys, Street Junkie here, and today's video we're going to be talking about this device right here, the Chromecast. This is Google's new Chromecast device, uh, 2015 version, I guess. Um, it's very much like the original Chromecast, um, just um, updated hardware, but I figured I'd show it to you anyway. So on the side here, you can see there's a bunch of applications that should work well with it, mostly video, um, Pandora's uh, audio um, for music. Along the side, you got some other ones that they say work quite well back some examples of streaming and actually plugged into the back of a tv right there as well what's included inside which you'll see in a second and then a little bit of stuff about streaming and then also mentioning that it's 2.4 or 5 gigahertz uh, screen mirroring and works on android iphone mac windows chromebook so very interesting let's go ahead and open this thing up while i'm doing that just want to mention to you guys that this is being recorded on a OnePlus 2, so if you're interested in camera quality, definitely uh, this should be a good example for you. Here you go, you can see the quick start guide, talking about how to plug it into your TV, what to do. Actually, and you'll probably see me do that, I'll do some uh, setup of it as well. And then right here we'll open it up and take a look. So there you go, there is the brand new Chromecast. So what is on this Chromecast? So first of all, it's got this um, Chrome logo right there on the front. Along the back you have this folded over HDMI cable which actually has a little magnet on it which allows it to magnetize and kind of hang very easily. It's kind of funny, I feel like I need to put it on my belt or something. It's kind of interesting. Other than that, right here around the side you can see we have a HDMI uh, port right there and then it looks like some kind of reset or power button on the side as well. Otherwise, that's it. That's pretty much the hardware. There ain't much to it. But this flex cable should make it easy to plug in to a TV HDMI and give you a lot of flexibility on where the device is going to be sitting. So, besides that, let's open it up a little farther. And underneath there, you have your cable. Very easy. Micro USB to USB. It does also unplug, which is nice because a lot of OEMs are going cheap and uh, they're keeping these permanent cables which is really kind of annoying so i love that it does that you do see a little bit of the uh, chromecast logo right there on the charger as well but that's pretty much it guys that's what's in the box let's go set this thing up so guys let's go ahead and uh, set this thing up so to do it you're just going to go to this site right here and the easiest thing to do on your phone is to just do this Chromecast.com slash setup. Google now is an amazing thing. So right uh, there it is. And that's going to link you to this right here, which then links you to the Chromecast application on the Google Play Store, which then I've already installed, and I'm just going to go ahead and open it up. So right here you can actually see, there it is right there. There is the Chromecast device on my network. And we're going to go ahead and click on the setup button and go ahead and set it up. So it's going to go ahead and connect over to the Chromecast. And this does this all through your home Wi-Fi. So you definitely have to have Wi-Fi set up um, at your house for this to function correctly. I think you can set it up without the Wi-Fi, but for it to interact correctly, it's all doing it through your home Wi-Fi. So basically it says, can you see these numbers on the screen, which I do. Yes, I see code. So we'll do that, and then what do you want to call it? So I'm going to call it, um, I'm just going to call it Root Junkie Cast. Instead of Chromecast, it's Root Junkie Cast. And I'll enable guest mode, that's fine. And then send crash reports to Google, no thank you, and set name. This is the Wi-Fi network at my house. It asks for the password for it. So I'm going to go ahead and put that in really quickly. And then go ahead and connect. And you can see that now it is connecting to that network. Basically what happens is uh, Chromecast sets up basically a mini hotspot that you connect to the Chromecast through Wi-Fi. And then it says, well, your phone was on this network, so then we got to connect the Chromecast to that network. So that's basically kind of a rough understanding of how that functions. So there you go, you're set up. So now we're going to just browse cast apps. And you can see all the applications that allow you to cast to your TV. These are the main ones. And actually, 
all of these are actually on my phone, which is pretty cool. I want to actually open up YouTube, and I want to show you guys really quickly how I can cast this right here to the TV. So right up here is the cast button, and you just click for me, Root Junkie Cast, and it's going to go ahead and cast that video to the TV. So there you go, you can see the video. The other thing that's cool is you can come down here and you can pick another video and you can add to query. And then you can come up here and you can hit next and it should go to the next video in the query. Or query, I, I, I'm terrible with that word. Oh, and it's commercial, so um, I'll pause that. Probably one of the other things that's really cool is like you can use something like Plex. This is something that I like a lot. You can do all kinds of videos and stuff with it. So I'm just going to do some music though really quick. I'll show you some that really, really fun just really quickly. So it also can just do music if you want. It doesn't have to do video. But there's lots of applications that have video on it. So put some uh, music to it and we'll just cast it. See, here we go. It was on the phone. Now it's casting to the Plex application. And... There you go. So you've got music, you can cast music, you can cast um, video, totally works quite well. Very, very well. Go ahead and pause it. So there you go, that's basically the Chromecast on my TV here. Very nice, very easily integrated. The Chromecast application on the phone just makes this really seamless and almost any video application at this point has that uh, app cast button right up there in the top corner which just makes it easy to fling it right to your tv so that everybody can enjoy it so guys that's about it that's going to wrap it up for me i hope you have enjoyed this little video on chromecast and maybe learned a little bit more about it again this is recorded on my oneplus 2 so if you're looking for some camera quality on that and some video test on it this would be a great video to look through that information as well i did find a way to lock the camera focus so it's not refocusing all the time by just holding down on the screen for a little bit and it'll lock the focus. So that's a quick tip if you're looking to know how to do that. But that's about it. Catch you guys in the next one. Root Junkie out.